My baby is scared, y'all. I'm going live on Facebook. My baby is scared, y'all. My baby just told me. My daughter just told me that her butt had a toy stuck in it on a, on, on on my visit. I'm I'm tired. My baby is scared to go back to this house. My daughter is telling me my daughter butthole is red right now. My daughter butthole is red right now, and they won't do nothing about this. My baby is scared, and she just told me that she couldn't boo boo. My daughter just told me she couldn't boo boo because it's been a toy and stuck in her butt. It's a toy stuck in her butt, and her butthole is red, and they're telling me that they're gonna send my baby back to this house. They're telling me that I'm that, that I have to send my baby back to this house. And she need medical treatment. She need medical treatment. My daughter, my daughter is scared to go to this house. And she just said, Kalia, tell the people what you just said. Kalia. Somebody put a toy on your butt. And you can't boo-boo no more, right? We're not going through this again. Let's go. My daughter, my daughter. Yeah, my daughter butthole is red. Can we call? Can we call nine one one? I'm finna call nine one one. I'm finna call nine one one. I finna call the police on y'all. I finna call the police, y'all. I can't do nothing else about this. I finna call the police right now. They're trying to take. They're trying to take my baby. She just said the house that she be at. Uh, somebody put a toy, and she can't boo boo no more. They don't want to call the police about this. Nine one one. I need an emergency. I need an emergency. I need an emergency. I'm at I'm I'm at Children's Home and Aid in East Alton, and my daughter just told me that her butthole been touched with a toy at the foster family. She's yeah. I'm in Alton. I'm in Alton. I'm in Alton at Children's Home and Aid, and they're trying to take my baby back to this house where she just said somebody touched on her at. And her butthole is red. And she told me she can't boo-boo and she's hurting. And she's scared. And I can't do nothing else. I'm going live on Facebook right now. My baby is crying. This is the second video. I have my baby on another video saying she's been touched on her private part in this house. My visits are supervised. And I'm trying to save my baby. I'm not going to keep letting her go back to these people. My baby is scared. They won't call the police. They're trying to send her back to this family. And this is the second time I've hotlined and reported sexual assault on my daughter. And I don't know what to do no more. I have another video. She's already, it's this case, this has already been under investigated once. Now, my baby butthole does not, my name is Kay Epperson. My baby butthole does not look right. It's red and she's scared. She's scared. My baby is scared. Don't cry, baby. I got you. That's what my boo here for. Yes. Yes. I don't. What's this address? Because my baby is saying she can't boo boo, and y'all just gonna put her in the car. She's saying her butthole hurt, and it's been a toy in her butthole. I'm calling the police. It doesn't matter because you call it, me. It, she it, still it, cannot leave with you. She, it, I don't care if she leave with me or not. She's not going to keep going back with these people. And this is not okay for y'all to keep letting my daughter get sexually assaulted. They are letting my baby get sexually assaulted in this home. They are letting my baby get, she, my baby butthole is red right now. I don't know what else to do. I'm going live, y'all. I got to save my baby. I have to save my baby. She is being touched by somebody in his home, and I don't know what else to do. <laughs> My name is Kay Epperson. <laughs> People to a dog have heard my daughter say this, and they're trying to take her back to the house. <laughs> I got you, baby. My name is Kay Epperson, E-P-P-E-R-S-O-N. Don't cry, baby. My She's four years old. And now her name's Kalia Epperson. Dad, you still on the phone with me? Kalia, K H A I A. I don't know what else to do. She, she told me to take her to the bathroom. She told me, Are you struck your nerve? My baby butthole is red and she said somebody stuck a toy in it. 
Okay, thank you. Right thank you. Thank you. Uh, do I stay on the phone? Uh, I'm recording everything she said. I got two videos of my daughter saying she's been touched in this house. The police is on their way. She needs to be with somebody else, y'all. I don't know what to do. I need help. I need help, y'all. I need y'all to share my baby story. I need help, y'all. To... I don't know what else to do. My baby's scared. My baby's scared, and I don't know what to do. It's okay, Kalia. I got you. I got you, baby. You hear me? You see these people? These people gonna help us. This video gonna help us. You hear me? I gave them all ten children's home and names. Why y'all can't give them the address? Okay. Why? Why y'all can't call them? Why y'all? Y'all just gonna hear it. Y'all, they gonna see, hear it, hear it, baby. Say this and take her back to the people. This is the second video. It's another video of my daughter saying she's being touched on her private part. I found these people on Facebook. I know who these people are. They stay in Glen Carbon. They need to get sued. They need to get. They need to get shut down. They are letting this happen to my baby. She, mommy, you telling the truth, Kalia? You telling the truth? I know, baby. I got you. Mommy got you. These people gonna help us. They, they gonna help us, Kalia. Mommy gonna tell your story. I'm not gonna let you go away and away from me. Mommy not gonna let you go away from me. And nothing happens today, okay? Today is gonna stop, okay? It's gonna stop today. I got you. You hear me? I love you. Give me a kiss. I love you. You hear me? And Dad, I'm still on the phone with you, but I'm going live. I'm going live. I love you. Give me a kiss. I love you. You hear me? And Dad, I'm still on the phone with you, but I'm going live. I'm going live because I got to, like, I did something got to be done about this. Y'all, my baby just said somebody put a, I'm sorry, baby. Somebody touched her butt with a toy and she can't boo-boo no more. And her butt hole is red and they're trying to send my baby back to this house. They, baby, I got you. She said, mommy, take me to the bathroom. Mommy, take me to the bathroom. I got a potty. I said, she said, mommy, I can't boo-boo though. I can't boo-boo. I said, why you can't boo-boo? Tell mommy what's wrong. She said, she said somebody put a toy right there. And I bent my baby over and I looked and her butthole is red. I don't know how a baby private part supposed to look, but it didn't look right. And they trying to send my baby back with these people, y'all. I don't know what to do. But now that I'm going live, they were just trying to snatch her out of my hand. I called the police. They were trying to take my baby from me and put her. They were trying to take my baby and put her back in the car just like the last video. My baby is on Snapchat saying, Daddy, yo, touch my private part. It's another video. I'm gonna, I don't know what else to do but to go public with this. I've been trying to I've been trying to fight for my baby by myself and I can't do it. I can't do it. I can't do it no more by myself. They keep taking her and sending her to this house. My baby's not telling me this stuff is happening to her for no reason. Something's happening to my baby. Dad. I can't I can't put my hands on these people. I'm gonna go to jail. I can't do nothing. I can't get violent. You are, you are arguing about fighting, but you're not concerned about a little girl saying she's being touched. You're you're aggressive with an adult, but you're not you're not aggressive about a she, the white man my baby back there. You this, this the second visit that you supervised when my baby said she's being touched. Yolanda, Yolanda, this is the second second visit. That my baby has been on that you supervise and you won't tell the police that she said she's being touched on in this house. My baby cannot poop right now. My baby can't boo-boo. She said her booty hurt. 
It's okay, baby. I got you. You hear me? I got you. You hear me, baby? It's okay, mommy. I got you. I got you. You hear me? I got you, Gillian. They not gonna do this to you no more. They not gonna do this to you no more. Okay. Whoever doing this to you, we finna, we gonna find out. They not gonna do this to you no more, baby. Okay. That's why they want to take you away from me because they trying to cover it up. They trying to cover it up. I know. They not gonna get you, baby. I got you. I got you, baby. I got you. You. It's okay. You don't gotta be scared with me. I told you you can always talk to my me. Okay. You always can tell me anything. You don't have to be scared to tell me nothing. Okay. I love you. I love you, Julia. If you need medical. I don't know what to do, y'all. I highlined the first time she said that she was getting touched on her private part, and they unfounded it. And they still let her be with this family. They still let her in this house. And the supervisor Victor wouldn't talk to the police and tell them that my three-year-old daughter said she had been getting whoopings. I have the Snapchat video of my baby saying, Daddy O touches my private part and whoop me on my booty. Now she's saying, Something somebody to put touch her with a toy on her butt and she can't boo boo. That's not nothing the kids should be telling me. She shouldn't even know what a toy is. She shouldn't be not being ever to poop right now. She showed me her butt in the bathroom and they just tried to take my baby. They just tried to take her out of here away from me. They just tried to take my baby away from me. They was going to put her back in the car and sit her with these people and let them take her to the hospital. They won't let me know where these people at. They don't, I don't know who these people are, but my baby's been telling me they've been mistreating her. And she want to be back with me. She be, mommy, I want to be back with you. But they, they trying to terminate my rights. They trying to throw my case under the rug. They won't let me do nothing about this, y'all. And I, I need some help. I need people to know what's going on with my baby because she's scared. And I, I, I'm scared now because they won't, let, they, they won't do nothing about this. Wherever my daughter is, she's getting touched on. She told me twice. And they try to intimidate her by being in this room so she don't speak. But my baby talks to me. She tell me everything going on with her. She tell me everything going on with her. And when she, when I just took her to the bathroom, I just took my baby to the bathroom and she hurried up and told me, Mommy, my booty, I can't poop. It hurts. Why? Can y'all go sit there and take her back there? Y'all gonna say y'all gonna keep letting this happen to somebody's child? And y'all supposed to protect her, right? Y'all supposed to be the people protecting her, and I'm the neglectful parent. I'm the one neglectful, and y'all neglecting her as a system. And y'all, so I can see if y'all was giving me unsupervised visits, but now y'all finna get in trouble because y'all are here hearing my baby say this, still taking her back to this house. How? How can you overhear a kid say that and still hop in your car and go home at night and lay down? This is the second visit that my daughter says she's been touched on in this house. And I'm not going to let her go back this time. I don't care who she go with. She should be able to go with a family member after this. Somebody should be able to reach out and get my baby for me. If I can't get her back, since y'all don't want me to have her back so bad, since at the end of the day, she ain't going to come with me still, my baby don't need to be going back to that house. And she needs to be com coming with either her dad family or somebody in my family. 
because she's not going back with them people. And this is the second report, and I got paperwork on it. And I got a, I got a video of my baby saying she being touched on, bro, two times. She on Snapchat saying she been touched. And y'all going to keep letting this happen to my baby, yo? I called the police. They didn't call the police. I just called the police because they were trying to take my baby and put her in the car on me. I said, I'm going to call the police, and they backed up off of me, and I went live. They were just trying to take my baby and put her in the car seat and send her back with these people. And I know who they are. I found their Facebook page. Lakita Fane. Lakita Fane is on Facebook, y'all. Her name is Lakita Fane. My daughter got pictures up on their Facebook account. Y'all go find these people. They stay in Glen Carby. My daughter, my baby said her butt. What's going on today? My baby said that um, she hurried up and told me to go to the bathroom with her before the visit was over. She she kept telling me, she was like, Mommy, I don't want to leave. I don't want to leave, Mommy. And she said, I got to pee. And then I, she, I, she, I took her to the bathroom and she peed. And then she said, but Mommy, I can't boo-boo because somebody put a toy in my butt. And I have her on Snapchat on another video from like a year ago of her saying, the man in the house touching my private part, mommy. I hotlined it. They unfounded it. And my baby butt look red. I don't know. I don't know. But he don't look right. And I, they were trying to take her back to the house. And I said, well, I think she need medical attention first before anything. You know, that should be right. Shouldn't she, if she's saying this, shouldn't she go to the hospital and set her back? Yeah, she can get treatment. She can get medical treatment. You can make sure that happens. Yeah. But this is the second time she said it. I have it on paperwork. I've talked to a detective. I've hotlined. They wouldn't investigate the video. They wouldn't They, they wouldn't investigate the video. What's your name, dear? Katie Epperson. You spell your first name? K-A-Y. Spell your last name? E-P-P-E-R-S-O-N. E-P-P-E-R-S-O-N. What's your middle initial? C. Your date of birth? 41997. What's the phone number for you? 618-808-1675. What's your address? 633 Monroe Street, South Illinois. It's okay, baby. I got you, okay? You Don't be scared of these people, you hear me? Don't be scared of them. You don't have to be scared of them. You can tell them. Can you spell that for me? K-H-A-L-I-A. Epperson. Okay. You don't have to be scared of them, okay? What's they, her middle initial? Um, M. M. And her date of birth? Four eight seventeen. Dad, you still on the phone? My yeah. father was on the phone, and he she told us. What, uh, what time did you get here? Um, we got here at eleven. That's our, my normal visit time. Eleven a.m. Yeah. Okay. And are you just about to pick her up and bring her here? Oh, oh, yeah. She's the supervised. Now, no, ten, ten minutes ago, when she was talking to Khalid, well, ten minutes ago, when she was talking to Khalid, they, were, they were playing on the phone and the toys and things. And, and, Khalid, and, and the mom says, Are you sad? She goes, No, I'm happy. Mm -hmm. so this is ten minutes ago. Okay. And, and then, you know, she told me, Mom, take me to the bathroom. I got a potty. Okay. Mommy, I can't boo boo. Didn't you say that, Khalid? You said that? You told mommy you couldn't boo-boo, right? Hold on, Tom. Did you say somebody put a toy on your butt? First of all, here's the thing, okay? First of all, we're not, we're not talking to a child, okay? Okay, that's not what we're here for, okay? We never talk to the child and convince them one way or the other of what has occurred or hasn't occurred, okay? Does that make sense? Short me, call and see Robin. Does that make sense? Do you understand what I'm saying? Okay. So we can get her the medical assistance that she needs, okay? Yeah. Ultimately, what would happen is I will get an ambulance here, mm -hmm. okay? And do you have a representative that would take her back to the house mm -hmm. originally? Mm -hmm. Would that person be able to drive in the ambulance to the hospital or try to travel behind that ambulance with her? I mean, yeah, I can. The representative? Are you yeah. that person?
mother. I'm going to buy a lighter with a little bit. Okay. You know. That's fine. Um, due to the fact that, like, I still have to abide by what the legal grounds are, okay? No, no. All her records are in uh, the Troy Hospital. Uh-huh. Because she lives, she lives in the... Uh, in, uh, <laughs> Whose records? Her, the the child. Okay. Well, she lives in the Maryville Glen Carbon area. Okay. And I, and I believe the foster parent usually takes her to Anderson. So okay. that's where all, they would know. Yeah, my baby the, not the lying. Um, she not doctor. lying. Well, it wouldn't be a pediatrician that she's going to see. Right. If there's alleged okay. sexual right. abuse right. or assault of any kind, right. it would be up to the mother to decide where she wanted her she child to go. She said she heard it. Guardian, DCFS is guardian to the so, child. So we would, we, would, we, would, we would take the child to the nursery and the foster care. It's so okay, damn, baby. And you would take them to Anderson instead of Children's or yeah, something that, across the Yeah, because that's true. He has her records there because he's been placed in that foster home for two years. So they would, they, they will. Out, when they look around, they already have They placed my baby years. in this right. Foster but family without telling me. I came up a week. Ago. I didn't know she was with these people. To have sexual assault kids perform. These, these are steps that we take to make sure the child is taken right. care of right. first step. Okay. A hundred percent. So trust of the us. Time okay. We investigated. That we're going to make sure it's taken to the child. Regardless. I caught this is the second time this happened and they target. We're here, here anywhere, sure that we recommend that they go to the barns or children's hospital because yes. they okay. have the medical facility that can sorry, sustain baby. the type of uh, and evidence logging and everything that's being done. It's like if I had a broken leg, would I go to Anderson? You know, how can it keep come up with it? shot in the head. Right. 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 No, I'm not going to go This is awesome. Like awesome. Like yes. Over here. Hey, Lakita. Let me, let me talk to Fonson real quick. Um, we're, we're, we're at the visit in the home office. She is scared. My baby is scared. She don't want to go back with the people. That. And, uh, <laughs> we're, we're not here for that. Okay? Okay. She, that that's she, that you're saying. Okay? That's what we need to get her treated for. Okay? So, oh, it's the, based off of that, based off of that, okay? Who it, is responsible for this happening? It's not me. It's not them. Case manager, she's with a family. Who's supposed to be responsible? Who else is supposed to be responsible but four year old little girl? I understand that. Isn't that in daycare? Going, that's why we are going to take the, the correct steps to go through and see exactly what has happened. Okay. <laughs> Charnique, go get Auntie Robin now. We I need Auntie Robin. I need Auntie Robin in this situation. Go get Auntie Robin, Charnique. They go take her to the to Anderson Hospital, children's. children's Hospital. Yeah, that's the correct step. Right? This, yeah, I mean, you, you you would agree with it, wouldn't you? Mm -hmm. that you ultimately, I'm not saying that or take her back to the house or anything. I'm saying that she would. Take she would. Too. I would commit, they were trying to take her back to them. Yeah, but I was trying to get medical true. attention first, and that's and that's why you have us. That's why right? I called you guys. So you're agreeing that we're taking the correct steps to yes. her the treatment. That she, she don't want right? nobody to touch her no more. She don't want nobody to touch her no more. We, we got to take the correct steps, okay? <laughs> so, you see my baby holding me? I understand that. I can't be. What? Dad, she yeah. don't want nobody to touch her. She no more nobody to touch her no more. My baby's scared. Why can't she get the correct treatment? Correct. Okay, I can't. She want me with her. Uh, she, you see my baby. She, I, I understand that. I understand that. But here's the thing: is that uh, I can't. My baby don't want. When you become, when you become emotional, like this, you are not helping the situation. I'm not being emotional. I mean, but my business. And I understand where you are. But here's the thing: is that you understand the legal grounds of where we are. Okay, they have guardianship of her. Correct. And I can't be involved at all. You can be involved, absolutely, but they have guardianship of her. I'm saying so, I can't be a part of the hospital visit right now or anything. That'd be up to them. I have to come to them. That's up to them. Yes, they have guardianship of the child. Y'all, they is trying to do my baby. I'm not saying you guys are, but this family is not I, right. Well, I didn't say the family, did I? No. I said the, the, the caseworker that's, that has your child right now okay? is responsible for that. He's going to take her over. He's going to have. He's he, responsible for. He, I'm going to release her to his custody, so he takes her to get the the <laughs> correct stuff done. Okay. And and I he, he's, he's a caseworker, correct? So he's he's the he's, person that he's can the let the me know if yes, he's the mediator between the two parties. 
Okay. You okay, baby? Mommy got you. You hear me? You so, hear me? We can... Leah, we gonna get you back. You hear me? All these people gonna help you. You hear me? Then we gonna get you back. You don't gotta be scared no more. Mommy got you. Okay, I love you. Okay? Mommy love you. Okay? I love you. You don't gotta be scared no more. Okay? I know you don't want nobody to touch you. I know you don't like them people. I know you don't want it time to take you. I know, baby. You a, you a baby, and, and, and you can't fight for yourself. And mommy fighting for you right now. You hear me? Mommy fighting for you right now, okay? We, we You okay now? You hear me? You okay now? You okay, Julia? They're they not going to do this to you no more. They're not going to do this to you no more, baby. You don't got to cry no more. You hear me? Mommy got your back, okay, baby? Mommy got you. I got you. You're not telling me this for nothing. Something happening to you. Yeah. Yeah, something happening to you at that house. Yeah, with them people. With your other mom. Who doing it, baby? Tell me. Who doing it to you? That's my brother. Your brother. That boy. Your big brother. Do he tell you stitch, snitches get stitches? No, Bentley. Who? Bentley. Tell, tell, tell me. You can talk, baby. Talk. Uh, Who is it? Bentley's my mom. That boy did it, your big brother, in the house? Yeah. Yeah. It's okay. It's going to stop. No, who, nobody else is having been anybody else. Could you talk to me? Because it hurt. It hurt. I know, baby. Mommy got you. Don't cry, baby. Mommy got you. It's okay, baby. I got you. I love you. You hear me? I love you. Give me kiss. I love you. I love you, baby. <laughs> You're going to be okay, okay, princess? Nobody's supposed to touch you right there. That's bad. You know that's bad? Yeah, that's bad. It's okay, you want mommy. It's okay, let go, let go. It's okay, let go, let go. Mommy got you now. You hear me, mommy got you now. Yeah. Mommy got you. You don't have to go back to that bad place no more. That's a bad place. Yeah, you okay, baby? <laughs> you don't gotta go back no more, okay? We gonna see, we gonna, we finna fix, we finna fix what's wrong, okay? The hospital, the hospital gonna help you, the doctors, the police, they help you. They helped you today, you hear me? Mommy got you, okay? I got you. Mommy got you. It's okay. It's gonna stop. Okay, you a baby. That's not supposed to happen to you. And I'm so sorry, baby. I'm so sorry. Mommy, sorry. You the fuck? Okay. Okay. Just like. Okay. Okay. All right. Don't cry. Stop What's crying. What's your daughter's name? Kalia. Kalia. Don't cry. Okay. And how old are you? I'm 24, I'm and she's four. The reason we don't talk to or ask questions is because juveniles, especially under the age of 10, don't recognize time or space. It's, it's okay, baby. Mommy got you. It's okay. Yeah, they don't recognize time or space. So in the morning, she might tell me what she had for breakfast three mornings ago because she doesn't understand time. Uh, no, she yeah. doesn't understand space. Yeah. Like, she can where are we at outside? How far away it is? It, you, you'll kind of remember, like, if as an adult you go back to a place you lived when you were a child and you thought it was much bigger. Yeah. And you go back there now and you're like, oh, I know, like, her expand is, so, is very. This yard is so small. When I was a kid, I remember it being huge. Mm -hmm. So that's the same thing. Don't understand time and space. For that reason, and also because incidents like these are traumatic, they don't file them away and catalog them. The it's like she tried to tell me before she was leaving. The way that adults do, okay? So we don't ask juveniles questions. And when I say we, 
I mean, me as the police, detectives, parents, social workers, hospital workers. You by law. Her, you take her to the emergency room, not by law, because it's been established through the court that it's not in the best interest of the child, because you're making the child who doesn't understand time and space relive as would be there. A representative I've, from the police department would be I've there. I've hotlined this before. Okay. So and they, 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 my baby is on Snapchat. Like we was just on our visit. It's, it's still in my Snapchat history. And she said, I've been getting touched on my private part in my, I've been getting whoopings on my butt. I still have this video. I They said the same thing to me as police. You know, I called the police, but they took her from me then. I just called before they tried to take her. But what we don't do is what we're doing right now. I'm finna end this.